each of these notes is in an octave row. The melody array in Bira and the harmony array in Bira both have octave rows, which means that all these notes in a row are all related by octaves, meaning they all have the same letter name. This is A sharp, this is B, this is C, C sharp, D. When I hit this whole row of four notes, I'm hitting this just different octaves of the same note. Now I can sweep across them like this, but I can also play them like this with putting each of my fingers on them and the thumb underneath and play them all at the same time. They have a very different sound when I do that compared to... And one of the things about these octave rows is is that they give you a chance to play a new kind of dynamics. Now dynamics are amplitude differences and the array and beras, both the melody array and the harmony array, give you a lot of opportunity for dynamics. You can play very, very softly or quite hard. So here's an example of, of a very soft. And then... So that's dynamics, and if I were to play a little thing with dynamics, it'd be like, say... instruments unique in the instrument world, I have the chance to do what I call octave dynamics, which means that I can don't I'm not just limited to playing louder and softer, but I can include more or fewer octaves as well, which is a whole different kind of dynamics. Here I'll use just octave dynamics and play with the same amplitude. differences in amplitude and octave. dynamics and amplitude dynamics happening together. Something that you don't really, you can't really do with the same faculty on other instruments. You can't really just go and have these different, you have to literally play each octave with a separate finger. You can't do that with one finger. For example, here's me playing the top octave loudly and the bottom octave softly. Here's me playing the bottom octaves loudly and the top one softly.
here's the middle ones louder. And the, you know, and I can also, the other thing is, I can reach these octaves with one hand. I cannot do this on other instruments. To reach from my thumb all the way to this talk octave, or even from here to here with, with one hand, you can't do on other instruments. This means that I can play when I'm playing combinations of notes, like say, a big chord like this, I can reach voicings, I can reach different combinations of notes, different octaves that would be impossible to play on other instruments.